have a chance to give back to our community. News 8 is teaming up once again with the Red Cross for another celebration of Heroes Blood and Food Drive. News 8's Chris Crow live at Pachanga Arena with how you can help, and you've got a special guest there. Yeah, we do. I mean, look, 150 appointments all filled up today to donate blood, but you can still come by today to help if you really insist on wanting to help out specifically today. And the way that you're going to do that is by donating food. And joining us right now is Jim Flores with the San Diego Food Bank. And Jim, we've been working together a lot yeah, during this lot pandemic. Um, we've had a lot of discussions. How is the food bank doing now? We hear from the, obviously the Red Cross saying that the, the need for blood never stops. The need for food never stops as well. You know, we're, we're uh, serving people at an unprecedented rate. You know, initially we went from uh, feeding about 350,000 people a month. That spiked up to 600,000. It's come down a little bit, but now we're starting to see a trend. People lost the $600 as part of the um, unemployment, and the people who went back to work went off unemployment now are back unemployed. So now that we're starting to trend back up, but there are a lot of people in our community that really don't know where the next meal is coming from. How did the idea to help out with the celebration of heroes come about, and then how can people help out today? Well, you know what? We have a great relationship with the Red Cross. We have for a long time. So, you know, nonprofits, uh, collaboration's a big deal. Sean's a buddy of mine. So, really, they asked us, hey, do you want to participate in our blood drive? We'll, we'll raise some food and we'll help people in need. And then, for people at home who maybe haven't been aware of some of the previous drives that you guys have done, what is the best, what are some of the best items to bring, obviously, to a center so like this? Anything non perishable, you know, works. Uh, protein reigns supreme because people who have less resources, you know, protein costs a little bit more. People make fun of me because I'm obsessed with peanut butter. You know, it's high in protein. Kids like it. Too expensive for us to buy. But any protein item uh, works or any non-perishable. Okay. Well, Jim, thank you so much for joining us today. And thank you for helping out uh, with the celebration of heroes. And again, guys, from 8 a.m. already happened, right? We're, four, we're three hours ahead of that till 8 p.m. So 12 hours, a chance for San Diegans to give back. That time is getting smaller here. We have until 8 p.m. today here at the Pachanga Arena for you to stop by to don donate uh, some of those food items. You can't miss them when you drive in through here. You will see, obviously, those with the San Diego Food Bank volunteering to help take that. Uh, it's real simple. You drive through, they'll take it out of your truck or vehicle uh, and make sure that it gets to the San Diego Food Bank. Eric Costello.